So the innovation is inspiring, the excitement is palpable, and we are seeing incredible things that are happening among our university partners. I think it's just the beginning. What I'd love to show you now are a couple of major advances that we will be bringing to market this year to help our educator partners create with more uh, efficiency and speed content that's gonna help learners around the world. One is by integrating generative AI into the course building process. We'll take a look at a prototype uh, in a second. And also some really fast progress that's being made in creating more immersive learning environments using virtual reality, augmented reality, extended reality from a number of our, our, of our top partners. But let's start by welcoming Tatiana to the stage, our, one of our lead designers. Tatiana, hi, nice to see you. Hi. And Tatiana's gonna talk a little bit about a new capability we're developing to build courses using generative AI. Tatiana, can you describe it a little bit? Thank you, Jeff, yep. and hello, everyone. As you know, Jeff, Coursera works with educators and learning and development managers from around the world through our work with our university partners, our Coursera for campus institutions, and our Coursera for business customers. One common theme we hear from all of you is that you are all looking for easier ways to create and curate content that meets the unique needs of your learners while driving learning outcomes through high quality assessments. So in response to your feedback, we are developing a product concept to reduce the time to create high quality courses by building a set of authoring capabilities powered by the exciting latest AI technologies. Here's a preview of what that could look like. All right, Tati, let's take a look. Let's meet Jenny. Jenny wants to help her learners grow their leadership skills. She has some of her own content to get started with, and she knows Coursera can take what she has and build an engaging private course in only a few clicks. Here is how we're helping Jenny. She can build her course manually or save time by getting assistance. Coursera's easy authoring helps Jenny build out the content. She can tell her what she wants the course to be about and the skills she wants learners to gain. For example, a leadership course covering skills including communication, team building, and diversity, equity, and inclusion. In addition to her content, Jenny is also looking to include video clips from participating partners to supplement her private course and make it more interesting and relevant for her learners. She can add her files as source materials, such as recordings of previous lectures, training sessions, or written documents like a syllabus or a list of skills. Now, Jenny is ready to generate a course draft. Coursera will analyze her inputs and create a course structure, generate content from her uploads, recommend existing Coursera content to include, and apply pedagogical best practices. Through easy authoring, a first draft of the course was created for Jenny based on the input she gave it, and now she can review and edit the content. There are a few modules, some videos that are from her upload, which were split into shorter clips, alongside videos from other authors, and an auto-generated reading and assignment. Let's take a look at the first video. This is a clip of just the introduction from Jenny's original upload. The preview includes an auto-generated summary derived from the transcript and highlights to jump to each video segment. Jenny can adjust the way the video was trimmed and tweak the summary. She can also edit the generated transcripts and skills that are tagged to this video. She can check out the videos from other participating institutions that were suggested to add to the course. This one looks interesting. Jenny can watch the preview, read the summary, or skip to the highlighted segments of the video to get a quick sense of it. She can also look through other alternatives by telling Coursera what she's looking for, such as finding the most popular videos about Module 1. It suggested three other videos, 
after previewing them, she can decide which ones to use to supplement her course. A reading was also auto-generated with a glossary of keywords based on the content in this module. An assignment was auto-generated based on the transcript of the uploaded videos and other content in the module, which is great because it will have taken her a long time to build these from scratch. She can add more questions to create more options for variability. Once Jenny is ready to launch the course, she can review the auto-generated course name, description, skill tags, and logo. Now, Jenny's private custom course is live, and learners at her organization are on their way to growing their leadership skills. Jenny can't believe how easy it was for her to create an engaging private course in Coursera. Our vision is to streamline customized course creation for educators and customers like Jenny using a plan of content to meet learners' unique needs. All right, Tatiana, pretty exciting. Obviously very new, but this idea <laughs> of helping customers and partners just create faster, easier courses using expert content is like a big part of our future. It is. Besides all of that, it supports launching the best content across top brands in a single learning experience. All right, so uh, for all the customers and partners who are like, hey, when can I start banging on this thing? What are our plans in terms of making this available? Sure, we are developing a pilot with a set of our content partners that will launch later this year. We'll be sharing more information with our partners and customers in the upcoming months. Today, we are recruiting educators and businesses willing to collaborate with us as participants in this pilot program. You can reach out to your representative if you want to join. All right, so we're recruiting for pilots. If you're interested in course building using generative AI, call your representative. Tatiana, thank you so much for thank joining Thank you, Jeff. Us.